please stand for a moment of silence, followed by the pledge. And now the pledge. I, I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Good morning, I'm Tia Ruiz. These are great moments in black history. Shonda Rhimes is an American television producer, screenwriter, and author. She is best known as the showrunner creator, head writer, and executive producer of the television medical drama, Grey's Anatomy. It's spin off private practice in the political thriller series, Scandal. Welcome back to this February 8th edition of the Daily Grail. I'm cool. And I'm conceited. I wish to. <laughs> uh, happy Opera Day. The opera has been around forever. You just need to make sure you stay away from the phantom. Scary dude. On this day in history, in 1978, a severe blizzard in New England finally ends the region begins to dig out from under several feet of snow. <laughs> Some areas received as many as 55 inches of snow in just three days. In just three days. Now that is a blizzard. Today it's time for another installment of Did You Know? Here we go, number five. Did you know the Eiffel Tower has 1,792 steps? Grab your Fitbit and let's go! Number four. Did you know Niagara Falls could fit four, could fill 4,000 bathtubs every second? It could probably give you that shower massage as well. Number three, did you know the Taj Mahal in India is made entirely out of marble? Sounds slippery. Mar <laughs> Number two, did you know the Statue of Liberty's mouth is three feet wide? Speaking of big mouths. And number one, <laughs> did you know Mount Everest is 5.5 miles high? You'd think it would be a little warmer that close to the sun. Share these fun facts with your friends and impress them with this useless information, even though they watched it also. Okay. Speaking of the fact <laughs> of the matter, the weather today will be partly cloudy with a high of 68 and a low of 57 with a 30% chance of rain. More rain expected tomorrow, so plan accordingly. Stay dry, my friend. We'd like to wish a happy birthday today to Jonathan Garcia, Carlos Saffold, and Kelsey Walker. We hope you guys have a wonderful birthday today. Hey, students. Go to yearbookordercenter.com to order your yearbook for the seniors. You can submit ads there as well. You have until March 12th with a full page, you get a free yearbook. Yes, yes. a free yearbook. The math works out in your favor. Yes. See our Daily Girl social media posts to see what all is due and when it's due. Yearbooks are just $100. Get it taken care of. New schedules have been posted on Daily Girl social media, so go find out when your friends are competing. Get out there and cheer them on. They'll thank you for it. Lady Wildcat flag football, first day of practice is February 16th. The first game is March 3rd. Hope you're excited to leave it all on the field. Tennis begins February 9th. Baseball Diamond Classic will be on the 9th, as well as softball starts February 11th. Track and field begins on the 12th. We are so proud of our Lady Lifters. The state competition will be February 11th. We have four Lady Cats heading to state. Jamika, Kenja, Carson, and Mallory. Good luck, ladies. Guys, weightlifting begins February 8th over at Keystone. Keystone State, Pennsylvania. Visit biggerk12.org slash BCHS and click on the calendar for a full schedule or you can follow Daily Growl on Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook to stay in the know. Remember students, in case you haven't heard, anyone interested in trying out for sideline cheerleading for the 2021 to 2022 school year, there will be a mandatory parent meeting mandatory. on February 22nd in the gym at 6pm. It's just around the corner. Also, don't forget about the mandatory, mandatory, mandatory cheer clinics on March 8th through the 11th. Cheer trials will be March 12th. You must attend the mandatory your, your parent meeting. <laughs> and you must have a 2.0 GPA to try out. That's mandatory. Write it down today. 
Make sure you're aware that this year's mandatory prom is now scheduled for April 16th, 2021 at the Prime F. Osborne the Third Convention Center. Mark your calendars. It's mandatory. No, it's not. Tickets will be on sale soon. It's mandatory that you buy one. Seniors will be voting or else you'll get expelled. On superlatives next week, so begin thinking of who you'll vote for. Scholarships have been posted on the school and district website. Seniors, be sure to check out bakerk12.org slash bchs and click on the guidance for additional scholarships all scholarships are due march 12th some require essays so be sure to look at requirements before sitting down hey yo juniors <laughs> this is a reminder that herf jones will be on campus thursday february 11th during lunches in the cafeteria to deliver junior class rings if you ordered your ring and paid your balance due you can pick up your baker county high school class ring if you're still interested in ordering your class ring, please bring a $60 deposit and Herf Jones will help you with the order. Hey seniors, Herf Jones will be on Is campus to assist uh -oh. you with your cap and gown graduation announcements orders Friday, February 12th during all lunches. This will be final on campus order date. Be the final on campus order date. Please Man. bring, please bring your deposit and order form to order. If you need order info, it is available in the front office. It's time for Riddle Me Monday. Here we go. Matt is the 50th fastest and the 50th slowest runner in his school. Assuming no two runners are the same speed, how many runners are in Matt's school? It's mandatory that you figure it out. Have your teacher submit your class's best answer before second period. Good luck. That's so easy. And what is it? What is it, Seth? It's a fantastic Monday, wild crats. Um, Cr uh, Critten. Mandatory Quill. Monday wildcat. We'll see you. A mandatory wildcat Monday. Tomorrow. Yeah. <laughs> Actually, we won't. Someone else will.